on camera, an armed woman walking up to a neighbor's home and then shooting and injuring another neighbor's dog. So take a look at this video behind us. This is security video from the scene. That Greenwood woman tonight faces charges of animal cruelty. Our Jenny Runovich talked with police and the dog's owner today about this violent attack. Well, the good news is the dog survived, but video of what happened here is difficult to watch, and police say it directly contradicts what the suspect says happened. Video evidence shared by the Sheriff's Department with 13 News Hello. shows 73-year-old Marion Martin on a porch ripping a gun. Moments before, she claims a pit bull named Polo came at her, forcing her to shoot. But prosecutors and Polo's owner saw something vastly different in that video that led to animal cruelty charges. In that video, I didn't see a dog that was of any threat to her. She was really the aggressor in that video. I would have to agree, it's, it's disturbing. Her statements don't coincide with what you see in the video, certainly. Polo, who family says is a sweet, calm dog, had gotten out of his fence February 4th. That afternoon, Martin called 911, saying a dog was running loose, attacking people and their dogs. Told police she went to her neighbors to warn them, armed with her 22. Ten minutes later, watch as Polo enters the frame. Martin moves closer to the dog, takes aim, and fires. Two shots. One hits him in the shoulder. She fires again as he's running away. He didn't growl at her. He didn't bark at her. He didn't pretty much didn't even acknowledge her. He didn't charge at her. He had his head down and he was sniffing the grass, what dogs do. And she fired at him again as he was running away. That, to me, your intention was to not hurt him because you had already hurt him. Your intention was to kill him. We reached out to Marion Martin. She didn't return our call. Yeah, come on. Meanwhile, Polo is recovering from the gunshot wound, although still walking with a limp. His family hopes the criminal charges send a message. Worried about a loose pet? Get police, not a gun. It's not okay to just walk in broad daylight in the afternoon with a weapon to go hunt down anything. In Greenwood, Jenny Runovich, 13 News.